Howdy folks, Luke Simons with you. Back to the Basics 101. We're up here in the Big Bighorn Mountains, Wyoming. Absolutely gorgeous waterfall. My brother's standing right on top of that waterfall. Hope you don't fall, that's a long fall. Folks, if you've ever heard of Northern Arms, I'm gonna show you something here. As most of you probably know, I carry a pistol pretty much everywhere I go. And <clears throat> called North American Arms and I've carried this pistol around for I don't know I suppose boy since 1999 maybe um, maybe 2000 something like that it is very very small this is my index finger five shots five shot revolver all rock ready to rock and roll you can see that and this is how she fits your finger right here and just pull it back and she pops like a big firecracker i'm telling you um, in fact it'll shoot right out of your hands with what it'll do <clears throat> but anyways a unloaded gun is just a paperweight in my opinion of course around children it's got the half cock mechanism that's half cocked that's the safety anyhow saying that I carry that pistol around a lot of the times I just like to have it just because just because but I've always wanted one of these North American uh, belt buckles now they make several varieties of these and we're doing a review just on this variety right here now if you can see that the gun fits in here just like so just Slip it in, hammer in first. Ah, I'm trying to do it, I can't. There we go, just like so. And it's a magnetic, and then it, it flips, and that's your safety. So this part right here holds your hammer in, and this part here holds your trigger in. And if you want the gun out, you just slip this back over here like so, pop this out, and she's ready to rock and roll. See that? Okay, pretty slick, pretty slick little tool. Um, and it just pops out like so. But anyways, so, that's what it is. Absolutely awesome. However, look at this, it's very thick. That is a very, very thick belt buckle. I'll show you a backside right here. The problem is, is this part right here, cheapo. It's cheap. North American Arms, I love this pistol. I love what you've done here. But I would make this a little bit narrower through here is what I would do. Big time, actually. Love how you kept this out here like this. Um, I love that. I would change this right here into something flat so it's, it's not open. I would make it so this is just a flat piece of steel with just like a finger lock on it instead of this. Now, I'm sure you have your reasons for doing what you did, but love the magnet, love it. Um, a buddy of mine has the one where a piece of metal goes up the barrel, and I, I'd have to say, I really like that too. Really like that too. This is where the problem comes in. This pops off all the time, just like that. You'll be wearing it and your belt will come undone. I'm telling you what, folks, seeing how shallow that is, not cool. Not cool. Any good belt buckle, you want to run that so it goes almost all the way through. That's not even a quarter inch on either side of that. See this? Look here. Watch. Placement, boom, and boom. It's, love the concept, love what it's doing, but really, it's a showpiece. Until they address this, this is a piece of junk. I'm gonna have to return it. I would love this to be practical. I would love it to be practical. Um, and it's a quite large belt buckle. Um, it, it could be shrinked down a little bit. Uh, if you made it so it's practical, 
to carry. I don't want a showpiece. I want it real, real. And I, I've always wanted to get this engraved. You can see it says North American Arms here on the gun. Well, it's getting pretty wore out. It shoots 22 long rifles, what it shoots, I'm sorry. Five shots. Um, oh, I really wasn't wanting to do a review on the pistol itself, but um, I'll just pop this out of here quick. This, neat concept, really, really like it. Junk, junk, absolute junk. It's not gonna work. This here, she's fully loaded. Five shots of pure goodness. That's what you have. That's how you unload it and load it right here. And I don't think I have a quarter, but it's, you know, a quarter would go from here to here probably. So you just pop this in here like so, pop this top in, see that, pushes in, goes here, like so. Now you have a gun, it's ready to rock and roll. Keep her on safety. And I've carried this in my pocket. I've, I made a leather holster for my boot. Um, this gun pretty much goes everywhere I go. And usually I carry another gun with me besides this gun because this is just a Saturday night special uh, gun, which is high, high quality. I absolutely love that 22 gun. Unfortunately, I wore that up to this funeral way up in the mountains and can't keep my belt on it's just frustrating oh another thing um the safety this gun will not fit in here with the safety on with the half cock Ooh, skeeter it has to be in this position right here can't be in the half cock to be inserted and that magnet wants to suck that gun in See how that serial number is on there? Beautiful little gun. So you just pop it in. Watch this. I want to see if you can hear this. And without it being secure here, pretty awesome. Pretty awesome. Unfortunately, it's just a wall hanger because they cheaped out. You can literally buy a $12 belt buckle that's going to be better than that it's a heavy belt buckle if you have any kind of gut at all it's gonna pop off because they just didn't make it properly this would be better to be a one piece and thicker metal northern american arms if you can hear this this needs to be thicker and run all the way through solid that's the concept that's the concept otherwise love the gun Absolutely love the gun. All my friends love the gun. I don't know how many of these I've sold for you. I always wanted one of these belt buckles, but I'm gonna do an honest review. And this is not a, a good wearing item. The other thing I would do is I would take this here and I would make it so it's a hook like this. They tend to stay a little better. These ones here always pop off. And there's nothing worse than, than your belt buckle. You're not sure if it's gonna pop off, if you move right or whatever. But that, that has gotta go. Uh, originally I said that was okay, but that has got to change. That, that has got to be a hook, like so. Um, that's what a good belt buckle will do. Don't have any problems with this other than it's a little thick, a little heavy, but that's to be expected. This is absolute junk right here on the buckle itself and right here. This snaps off all the time as well. Folks, if you like these honest reviews, let me know in the comments. Like I said, I'm here for a funeral. It's absolutely beautiful uh, up here. It's gorgeous. Celebrating a, a life of a very loved person in our lives. And um, anyways, Till next time, may the Lord guide and keep you. Happy trails.